Unsuspecting Tabitha was happy to accept Lizzie's offer to watch Hamilfish in the movie room. Little did Tabitha know that Lizzie was determined to retaliate against her for causing Lizzie to be trapped in the Roblox game during her nap. While Tabitha was enjoying Hamilfish, Lizzie tried to sneak into Tabitha's room to place a microchip on her laptop so that her boyfriend Dion could remotely control the Roblox game. This plan failed when Tabitha caught Lizzie in her room. They argued, and Lizzie snapped her fingers and accidentally turned Tabitha into a pig and then a frog. Lizzie called Dion, who informed her that her new powers were a side effect resulting from being trapped in the Roblox game. Then Lizzie lost Tabitha and eventually found her in the backyard. She was so excited that she kissed the frog and Tabitha reappeared. Later on, Tabitha overheard Lizzie explaining everything to Dion and was surprised. She has now declared war on babysitter Lizzie and is determined to get her back. <laughs> OMG, this Friday is so busy. My dad has me getting some groceries for Nana Brown. I have to do a phone call chain to the girls for my babysitting support group for our bi-weekly meeting tomorrow. And the Perkins just called and asked if I could babysit tonight. <laughs> Oops, I dropped an apple, oh, but my arms are full. Hmm. Yeah, Dion, we definitely need to find out more about these side effects from the Roblox game. Like ASAP. Hmm. This is such a busy Friday. If I do this correctly, according to the book, this potion will have Lizzie back in the Roblox game in no time. <laughs> Here we go. Mm. just the perfect way to get Lizzie to taste this lollipop. I'll tell her to support my fundraiser for the Little Junior Ladies League. <laughs> my professor mentor, Dr. Janelle Nicole, will be happy that I reported new sales for my troupe and I get to get back at Lizzie. <laughs> This is perfect. Ah, Dion, I miss you so much. I can't wait for you to get back on Monday from the Young Tech Leaders Convention in Silicon Valley. I know. Ah, I'll be careful with these new powers. Hopefully, we can find a solution quick. One more thing. <laughs> Dion. I didn't know spending time apart would make you become such a warrior. <laughs> oh, that's right. The total eclipse is happening tonight. Boy, this Friday is so busy. Oh, hold on one second. Oh, no. 
Oh, Dion, that's my dad. <laughs> I was supposed to be at my Nana Brown's house like about 10 minutes ago. Yes, 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 Dion. I heard you. Don't touch any living organism during the eclipse because you're not sure what type of reaction my powers will have. Okay, all right. I love you. No, no, you, 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 you. Dion, I have to go. All right, love you. Bye. Dad. Cooper, this is going to work. Trust me. Once Lizzie tastes the lollipop, she will have a fully immersive simulation. It will activate her sense memory and she will be back in the Roblox game running from that piggy. <laughs> and, and this should reverse those powers. Regular Lizzie is already hard to deal with. Ugh. Of course, Mr. and Mrs. Perkins. I'm always here if you need me. Okay, see you at 10. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Cooper, I know all about the eclipse tonight. This Friday's very busy. Oh, oh, I gotta go. I, I think I hear Lizzie coming. Yes, yes, yes. I heard you. Don't touch any living organism during the eclipse because we don't know what the reaction will be. Got it. My main focus is to have her eat the lollipop so she's back inside the Roblox game. You just make sure that everybody in the crew are on their computers when I send the signal. Oh, oh she's knocking on the door. Bye. Hi, Tabitha. Hi, Lizzie Jean. Boy, <laughs> you're using my full first name. Are you doing okay? I am. Is there a reason I shouldn't be? Oh no. <laughs> I'm just glad you're in a good mood tonight. <clears throat> you know what? I, I feel like something is up. You only use my full first name when you want me to buy something. <laughs> oh, Lizzie Jean, you are so smart. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> My mentor, Dr. Professor Janelle Nicole, wants my troop to sell these lollipops as a fundraiser for the Little Junior's Ladies League. <laughs> we picked this color because we call ourselves the Bluetooth. <laughs> you know how much we love our technology. Sure. <laughs> I'll take three. <laughs> uh. Oh boy, three. Thanks. <laughs> you know, I'm all about the charitable work. That's how I became valedictorian. <laughs> well, I'll be in the study room if you need me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okie donkey. <laughs> Charlene, girl, <laughs> I know. <sighs> Babysitting is so hard. That's why I started the babysitter support group. Mm hmm. Oh, <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> Oh, 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 just a friendly reminder that your bi-weekly dues are owed tomorrow. Yeah, in tomorrow's meeting. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm hmm Yeah, just cash at me. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh. Hold on. <laughs> 
Uh, Charlene, I have to go. You know, babysitter duties beckoning. Okay, bye. Hey, Tabitha. <laughs> I just wanted to see if you wanted to come to the backyard and watch the eclipse with me. Also, we can have one of the lollipops. I was gonna make a few more calls, but... Hmm. <laughs> that sounds like a really good idea. Let's go, Tabitha. <laughs> The night sky, it's so beautiful. <laughs> Look, a shooting star. <laughs> I think it's called the Starlasia. <laughs> the eclipse. <gasps> yeah, this is a good time for the lollipops here. What's happening? What's going on? What just happened? Why does your voice sound weird? We switch bodies. We switch places. <sighs> Hey.